everyone, welcome back to my channel. And before getting started, I'd like to let you know that 2023 wasn't the best year for me to make videos. But now in 2024, I feel that my life has undergone enough changes for me to actually put out content about things that I believe in. This is a start to that. Um, before I go into the academic content about how third year was and how I've gone through those subjects, I wanted to make my first 2024 video about my vision board. A slightly foreign concept that I got introduced to last year and I was so sure that this year I was going to have a vision board. Now, uh, I don't really think I printed it out but it's I have definitely saved my vision board as my um, phone ka background. My initial phone ka background was this which is funny but now it's this. So yeah. So what is a vision board? Uh, my understanding of a vision board is just everything you want to do and want to be in the coming year and that's what my vision board is all about. Now the reason having this helps is because every single action that you take this year, every single decision that you take this year has to contribute to the kind of person that you have on your vision board. And I think that really simplifies all my decision making processes for the rest of this year. Let's say I have the option of eating a proper healthy mess meal versus eating let's say Domino's or McDonald's or any other fast food. It's easy for me to just choose mess food because in my vision board I want that gym body. <laughs> right. That doesn't mean I'm not going to eat enough of McDonald's or Domino's but yeah there are a few days where you can't control your craving. You can't do anything about that. <laughs> I am very well aware that my vision board is a little white girly but you gotta understand that I love the color theme and it's nice. Anyways, moving on to what my vision board looks like. I have included a bunch of my professional goals here. Attending way more conferences, scrubbing in in surgeries, clearing my USMLE, basically using most of my living time to study. Because I'm in fourth year and I cannot afford to not study. When it comes to my hobbies, I've obviously included singing, I've included art in here, I've also included a bit of partying because I need it. I put a slide of cooking because I think I'm gonna get my own kitchen this time and I feel like cooking is an activity that gives me a lot of peace. If I had to describe what my ideal day would look like, it would include a lot of studying and a lot of cooking. Along with this, I have included a bunch of other miscellaneous goals such as investing in female friendship because at the end of the day you need your girls. See, I've included other random things that are my aesthetic. For example, getting a new tattoo which I already did but hopefully more. Dancing in the rain, I guess. I've included a bunch of jhumkas and my desi aesthetic which is me. Uh, these aren't of a great significance to my vision board. It's more of the things that make me happy and if I want to look a certain way and that look makes me feel more of myself, then I would like to look that way. Another personal goal is to share a lot of conversations and a lot of chais with a lot of new people and that is something I'm actively working on. Obviously, I have also included a fitness goal in here because I very recently started hitting the gym. Things have only gone uphill ever since I've included gym in my lifestyle, which is why by the end of next year, I want to be a muscle mommy. Do I have any? Do I? Please tell me I have some. The reason I have this vision board is because at the end of this year, I do not want to feel like I haven't accomplished enough because that's one kind of feeling that has always been there wherein you don't account yourself for the achievements that you have gotten. And you can't keep living like that without appreciating yourself, which is why this vision board is really, really going to help you to see how far you've come. And at the end of this year, I'm hoping to make another video to tick off all the boxes as in whatever I've done. I know it's a very vague goal to put in there but I want to travel and preferably I do want to solo travel. Uh, there is something about Pahad and discovering yourself and you know all that other Bollywood crap. And yeah, I do want to get my driving license this year. Let's hope that happens. And this is me introducing my vision board to you. I would like you guys to make your own vision board too. It's very simple. Just get on Canva, get a bunch of pictures and inspiration from Pinterest and you got yourself a vision board. I, um, if you're struggling as to where to start, uh, you can probably divide it into uh, professional goals, personal goals, mental health goals, 
are the miscellaneous goals uh, and things that you really really want to achieve this year how you want to look this year any new skills you want to learn this year and most importantly include everything that's going to make you happy and that has been constantly making you happy because that needs to be a part of each and every year of your life i hope that really helps and i would love for you all to share your vision boards with me maybe you could just drop in the canva link uh, in the comment section or share it to me on instagram or any other social media platform but yes i'm really hoping you make one for yourself the video is kind of late but it's still january and you have a lot of time that was a simple small video but i will definitely come up with a video about how i managed to do third year with a lot of hurdles and a lot of struggles and i hope that video finds you soon anyways on that note i will say bye bye tata see you later